Think how much magic we see every day. Okay, I can send a text to Paul Mannix. The magic we don't see comes from algorithms set in motion by Thomas Kyleth. I think coherent thinking is one of the features of mathematical thinking. I like to have the math available to solve problems that people would be interested in. Just about every decade, Kyleth assimilated vast new material to make major contributions in diverse fields. We have to heat a wafer from room temperature to 1,000 degrees and then cool it so that this wafer can be moved out and the new wafer put in. And if you do this quickly enough, that's the rapid thermal processing. I've always worked with applications. Sometimes, you know, it takes many years for them to be actually implemented. And sometimes only the military has the resources to implement some of our early work. When I moved from one field to the other, I brought ideas from the old field into the new one, and this gave me an advantage over people who had only worked in the new field. Some of his work yielded deceptively simple results. You are correct. A signal processing algorithm was the breakthrough needed to manufacture certain semiconductors, making synthesized speech practical and cost-effective. Calling Nancy Camp, mobile. Its applications today are enormous. So it's a four-step process. You have a complicated real-world problem. You try to understand the solution, not just as a bunch of mathematical facts, but what the math is trying to really tell you about the physical problem. When you simplify the mathematical algorithm so that you can really implement it in practice, that's mathematical engineering. And just a little bit of magic. <laughs>